Oh, that's cool. That's cool. Oh, what the hell? Oh, what is that? That's a <coughs> tall stuff. A rock. Oh, that's is that a that's a tar seep. Oh, <coughs> cool. That's cool. Yeah. Can we stop the ship, please? They found one of these in the Gulf of Mexico. It looked it looked a lot more intact. This I can't think of any other thing that would uh hey. form it gr sticking up like that. I'm not sure. It, it also just looks like it could. I don't know why it would be sticking up. Otherwise, though, you could poke it to make sure it's not a rock. Oh, it is a rock. But oh, it is a rock. Uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, so if it's a tar seep, it, it's hardened um, because it's cool, and, and tar seeps in this area could could certainly happen. It has a very much of a 3D aspect to it. Yeah. Uh, if we want to stay here, we should probably bring the ship back a little bit. No, we can we can move on. I think. Okay. Uh, Chris, who's uh, in Rhode Island, says uh, that it looks like we're in between major fault strands of the East Ca East Santa Cruz Basin Fault, uh, crossing an upper fault strand associated with a lot of folding should still be coming, uh, but we may have crossed middle Miocene basalt earlier, and the coming fault zone should be in the middle Miocene sedimentary rocks. Cool. That's awesome. We'll keep an eye out for. Uh, for full to rock outcrops. Oh, it's a nice looking flounder. Or flat flesh. Flat yeah. fish. Wow, that is. Yeah, again, it, it's hard to tell underwater what types of rocks are, but that looks, fra based on the fracture, that looks like it could be basalt, which makes sense in this area. But we're still trying to go upslope to where there's sedimentary rocks. Wow, what a sponge. Wow. Oh, that's awesome. Might this be a chalice sponge? Uh, I think it is. Mark says that last uh, outcrop looked sedimentary to him with their fine layers near the base of the outcrop, um, which he thinks may be part of the Monterey formation that they just sampled before we came on watch. Yeah, Chris agrees that he doubts it was basalt or tar. Uh, may have just been sedimentary rock that rolled in from somewhere else. You can see some of the sedimentary layers maybe in that rock there, the way it's fractured and, and weathered. You can see how it's it's gone. Never mind. Um, yeah, but then it's co all coated with the manganese, so that's why it all looks black. I thought they just painted the rocks black to sort of emphasize the sponges and crabs. And yeah, it's <laughs> a good background. Yeah. It is pretty incredible how these outcroppings are clearly little oases and otherwise pretty yeah. sparse sediment desert. Oases, not oases. <laughs> <laughs> it works. Yeah, especially this early in the morning. It's good use yeah. of the word. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> There's Sean's uh, pump-up compliment for the day. Oh, yeah. <laughs>